the lady boys are picking a name out of this hat, we're, swa we're swapping wives. Warning, this vlog contains explicit language. Viewer's discretion is advised. Hey guys, so I am on my way to go cheat on my wife. Um, yeah, you heard that right. I am going on a date with Dina. We did wife swap. And I'm going on a Friday night date with Dina. Um, it's awesome because one, she doesn't have a child yet. So we are child free dating. Woo woo! And um, I just got off of work. I was, I texted her and I was like, can I please change out your place? Cause I'm still in my work attire. I didn't get to go back to the office. Um, this whole date thing is kind of weird in the sense that not that I'm weird like like Dina's cool hello hello hey ground can you hear me Okay, um, where are you? I'm uh, leaving work in Treasure Island. Oh, you're leaving Treasure Island. Okay, okay. Um, okay, cool. Yeah, let me text you right now. Okay, sounds good. Okay, bye. Bye. She's leaving Treasure Island. I live in Daly City. That's like not even fucking 30 minutes. Oh my God, I need to run. Fuck. Okay, fuck it. I'm gonna do the most minimal fucking makeup in the history of life. Mine, if I change at your spot, I didn't go back to the office. <gasps> she wanna come in my house. Bitch, she wanna come up in my house. Oh, now I gotta clean. See, the way I see it is, I gotta get hella ready, you know? She ain't my real girl. I don't really give a shit to be honest. I have gotten to the point of not caring what I look like. Now, if this was like a real date and I was really single at the age of 30, oh my god, how I would be really sad. No offense to anybody that's 30 and single for real. Don't fucking come for me. Don't fucking come for me. I'm just saying, like, if I were single at 30, fuck, I don't even know. I really don't know. I'd probably be a hoe. So, a little background on Dina and I. Um, my cousin uh, knew who Dina, like, her and Dina are super close. Um, and I was introduced to Dina a couple times um, over the years. But I never hung out with my cousin's friends like that. And then I came into the circle of friends that Leslie and Betsy have because they're our main connection to this group. Um, and then we became instant friends with everyone. And, and now we're friends with Dina and Erica and Vanessa and Akira. So, you know, that's how we know the group. And that's how I know Dina. Um, you know, she's been 
I guess, like, around my, like, well, no. She's been around my cousin for many years, um, but this is the, my first real, like, interaction in the sense of, you know, just, you know, doing this vlog has made me get to know Dina more and, and, um, and Erica as well and Akira and Vanessa. Um, but our relationship, friendship, is a lot more new with Dina and Erica. Um, so this date should be a blast. Kind of get to know Dina a little more on a more intimate level, just me and her. Um, and see how she's doing with her prego self. And you know, um, try to get a sense of who we really are. Um, because sometimes in a large group, you don't kind of get to know each other as much. Um, so this should be interesting and it should be fun, exciting. So you'll see later how the date goes. Original Chola eyeliner. Been wearing this since I was 15. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. Don't look up. That shit. It's the hardest thing to do, ladies. Your fucking eyeliner. Erica gave me this, actually. Erica buys me a lot of makeup. Alright, we're almost there, ladies. We're almost there. What time is it? Fuck. Oh, fuck. I gotta get the order now. Man, I ch I showered this morning. I didn't shower. I'm not freshly sho- Oh, shit. I'm not freshly showered. It's fine. Go, here we go. Ooh. I'm not happy with my eyeliner. I'm gonna tell you that right now. And usually, I would take it all off and redo it, but I ain't got time. Ahora, ¿qué voy a hacer con estas greñas? You're almost there. Well, I'm like, where the fuck is fine? <laughs> yeah. You're you know, almost there. Like, tell me I have to climb up fucking Mount Everest to get here? I know, see? This is our problem. <laughs> oh, she's all sensitive. She needs to fucking sit in the front seat, or she needs to sit in the middle, <laughs> or, she, or else she gets car sick, and like, she'll fucking get oh, out of the car, car and throw too. up, and she's just like, are you serious? Erica gets car too, that's why I don't trip him. I have bad rage. <laughs> I'm gonna chalk it up to the pregnancy. I'm gonna say that. Let's just say it's because of the pregnancy. No, it's just me normally. It's just how I am. Oh my god, I forgot my lipstick, baby. I'm not trying to say that. Oh my god, I forgot my lipstick, baby. <laughs> I have a white shirt on you, okay, lipstick on here. <laughs> that was fucking her, I didn't say that. Fucking crying. 
Like, do you see yourself in this dating world anymore? Like, it's kind of tough out there. <laughs> yeah, it is. Um, what? Like, can you imagine being like, oh, first date, no, you pay. No, I can't eat my taco because, you know, I'm trying to make a good impression. <laughs> like she did. <laughs> like she tried right now. I said, you better stop. Because I'm hungry, you're hungry. I was like. I don't want you angry. Eating my my nachos, try not to be a fucking fat pig. Yeah. Um, yeah. I don't think I could do it. I just don't think that the like the people out there isn't the quality that I I guess that I want. Maybe they don't have the same goals as me right now. Yeah. A lot of people are still like, oh, let's go party still. And I'm more like, oh, let's go try to buy a house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, let's. No, for sure. See, that's the thing. If I were single now, I would still want to party. I mean, of course, if I was single <laughs> now, I would still be I would still partying it up, and living that, La Vida Loca. Seriously, I think that I would, if I were single right now, I'd still be partying. I would not have my shit together. I really don't. The only reason I have my shit together is because of my wife. I like, can agree to that because I have my shit together because of the volley. She has like We'd really, be a hot mess. Yeah. Can you imagine if we both Jesus. were dating? Oh my god. Single. <laughs> we'd, we'd, be, <laughs> we'd be like, viva la puteria! <laughs> it just would not. No, it would not work. But did you ever party um, back in the day on Broadway? Like, no, I went a couple really? times. That place was my shit. We would party out there all the time. And we were barely 21. We it would party a lot in Oakland. Okay. I was more See, into like the I never ratchet in, crowd. I never partied and, in Oakland. Era un poquito, era un poquito ratchet. Yeah. Un poquito. <laughs> poquitito. Poquitito. And we would have been a mess if we yeah. actually would have caked it back in the day. We really would have. It would have been all bad. <laughs> what I'm talking about. Hey, this brother, man, he's one of my best friends. And one of my favorite comedians, man, he was just a cussing fan. He just opened up a CK Kirkman. This dude is about to blow y'all mind. Everybody start clapping, start clapping. Come on, come on, come on. Everybody knows. Feel good. Keep it going for the next month, y'all. Come on. Keep it going for the next month, y'all. 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 Oh, this is great. I'm just happy that I'm One hour later. Show. It was actually, that, that was funny. It was that funny. was hella funny. It was actually pretty funny. It was really tight, yeah. but it was funny. Yeah. It was funny. They had a good, like, what, five minutes? Uh huh. Five, ten minutes? Yeah, each, and it was like six of them. Yeah. So it was, yeah. it was good. It was good. Um, did it feel weird going out on a date with another woman? No. It didn't. At first, when I was getting ready, I did feel a little weird. I'm like, why am I trying to look hella good for somebody? Hi. <laughs> you look marvelous. Oh, thank too, you. <laughs> um, 
And then I was just like, okay, let's not do too much. I'm not gonna inhale it, you know. I'm not wearing a skimpy outfit like I normally would. <laughs> Cause you're pregnant. <laughs> so what? Um, but no, I don't. I don't think it was doing it at all. It was really fun. Yeah. I really enjoyed it, and I, I like it cause. Again, we're getting to really know each other, yeah. so it's really cool. It kind of really does give you that first date feel, for yeah. sure. As opposed to if I were on a date with like a known friend from years ago, that that we probably bullshit, you know. Yeah, shit but, talk. Yeah, which we still did, but yeah, yeah. we did. <laughs> no, on a different I, level. I loved it. Yeah, it was I thought it was fun. I think it's nice, also because we don't know each other that well yet. Yeah. Um, even though being from the same like circle of friends now, yeah. we don't have time to just like go one on one with each other. Yeah. So it's nice to start to build that friendship. Yeah. And I think we had a good couple of things in common, and we talked about a lot of things. We talked about a lot of things. Yeah. A lot of secret things. Haha. <laughs> yeah. You'll never know. Off record shit. <laughs> Off record. Yeah. We got deep. We for yeah. sure got deep. Yeah. So it was nice. I liked it. Yeah. It was awesome. Maybe we could do a second date. Yeah, I would totally do it again. Awesome. <laughs> it was fun. Lots of fun. Yeah.